Hey, it's Sue. And Amy. So we are going to make one of our favorite Thanksgiving side dishes today, which is a broccoli salad. And this sounds kind of funny for Thanksgiving, but it's really good with turkey. And actually, you can make it year-round because it's, it's a fresh salad that's just easy and delicious. And this is definitely a salad that you could do ahead of time and have in your fridge because it's only going to get better as it sits. So first thing you want to do is cut your broccoli into florets. Florets. Little oh, florets. Florets. Just go like that and cut them. And then they're really cute. Yep. Put in your bowl that you're going to serve it in. Now, don't throw the stems away. No. These make a great um, stir fry. We have it on our, our, um, our blog. So don't throw the stems away. Keep them and we'll show you, we can show you how to do that at another time. So what we're going to do is mix our sauce. Yep. Cream cheese. Again, this is another easy, easy uh, recipe. Apple juice? Nope. It's vinegar. Apple cider vinegar. Cider vinegar. But that's close enough. That's close enough. <laughs> do not substitute apple juice for apple no, cider. No, do not. No, no. Dijon this mustard? Is Dijon mustard. Sugar and some garlic salt. Mm -hmm. And a little bit of salt, too. And a little bit of salt. And all and you do is... The recipe will be on our blog, bellylifeliving.com. So if you need the exact amounts, we'll put it out there. And we're going to blend this up now. We whipped up the dressing for our broccoli salad, so now we're just going to add a couple tablespoons of onion. If you don't like onion, just, just leave, leave it out. out, but it's really good in there if you like onion. And a couple tablespoons of craisins. Actually, that's only one tablespoon. And let me just tell you, we're not huge raisin lovers, and this is like so good. It, it just adds the perfect amount of sweetness and kind of crunch. Yeah, and that's what makes it, you know, the cranberries go so nicely with turkey and stuff. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah, I, think, I think I never thought about it until just now. And so we're just going to add our dressing. This is the cream cheese, the mustard, um, vinegar, apple cider vinegar, and garlic salt and salt. And then we're going to toss it around. It's a It looks a little thick, but trust me, it coats really well, and it, it just... It tastes so good. And it gets better as you go. So if you yes. make this a day or two ahead of time, this part, it's it gets even better um, than what it if you made it the day of Thanksgiving. So highly recommend it doing it a day or two before And takes it off your plate. Yeah. It's a great salad. After you get the dressing all coated onto the broccoli, um, you're going to want to, at this point, you could actually put saran wrap over it and save it till your Thanksgiving day. But right before you serve, you'll want to top it with some bacon. And if you're a vegetarian and don't eat bacon, just leave it off. It's just as good. Um, just this is, this is really good this way. Um, and you can also use bacon bits if you don't want to make bacon. We actually, we actually made this bacon um, today um, to put on top, but um, you can do it either way if you want often, to. Yeah, often you use the bacon bits because it's so much easier, and if you're busy, it's, it's great. Yep. So I so this, take a bite of it. Yep, and this is our broccoli salad. It's so good. It's creamy. And the bacon adds a cool flavor. It adds a nice little zip from the um, apple juice. You'll just love it. Apple cider <laughs> vinegar. <laughs> it's really a good salad. Um, let us know if you try it. Happy Thanksgiving.